If you're anything like us at the Camping and Caravanning Club, you will love geeking out over seeing hundreds of caravans, campervans, motorhomes, tents and trailer tents all in one place. From the biggest RVs to the smallest backpack tents, the Caravan, Camping and Motorhome Show at the NEC in Birmingham offers just that. Plus, a fantastic offering of accessories for, for kit, cycling, walking and even water sports. The event kicked off with club president Julia Bradbury at the Inspiration Theatre. But on our stand, Swift is giving you the chance to win a Monza campervan with Club Care Insurance. And our technical team hosted presentations and Q&As with members and beyond in the Presentation Theatre. There's a great selection of must-see stands at the show and you can stay tuned for more reviews in the coming months by liking this video and subscribing to this channel. But let's start out in the club-sponsored Camping Zone with Emily. Thanks Hugh. Yes, if you're a fan of sleeping under canvas and you're looking for something new to kick off this year's camping, you won't be disappointed here. Hall 4 is the new tent and camping hall, sponsored by the Camping and Caravanning Club. Here there's a fantastic mix of tents, trailer tents and awnings on display. You'll see brands such as Van Gogh, Outwell, Coleman, Outdoor Revolution, Dometic, Zempire and Regatta, to name just a few as well as trailer tents from the likes of Opus, Camperlands, Cabanon and Trigano. And one of the many things we love about this show is that there's something for every kind of camper here, from big budget motorhomes and caravans, to family tents, and to those that have been designed for backpacking. And Rosie's found a great example of a lightweight tent that would be absolutely perfect for trekking adventures. Thanks Emily. Yes, I'm here at the camping zone, where you'll find Coleman's Cobra 2 tent just in front of its main stand. This classic lightweight tent weighs just 2.8 kilograms and is great for those backpacking adventures. Its tunnel design sleeps two people and combined with weather tech fabric means it's able to withstand even strong winds. Plus, its aluminium poles are quick to erect but don't add too much extra weight. This brand new colourway is in line with the rest of the brand's new range of active tents for 2023. And if you're looking for something bigger, you can also see Coleman's range of family tents at the show. Rooftop tents have grown in popularity over the years and UK-based company Tentbox is well known for these cool units. Here in Hall 5, you can see the launch of its two brand new roof tents that are a revamp of its popular Tentbox Lite. Firstly, the Tentbox Lite 2.0 that is a new and improved style on the original. This two-person tent comes with a dual layer mattress, additional storage pockets and features an extra skylight. Weighing just 50 kilograms, it can fit on top of even small cars, as you'll see here on top of this Fiat Panda. Next is the new Tentbox Lite XL, which comes with all the new features seen with the Lite 2.0, but is a four-person tent. This is much bigger than you might expect to see with a roof tent, however this increased space really opens up the opportunity for families and groups to go camping with the unit. It's worth bearing in mind the weight limit is 300 kilograms for this though. Both tents are easy enough to put up by simply unfolding and erecting the poles on each side. And you have the choice of two colourways for both. The sunset orange, seen with the Lite 2.0, or the slate grey as seen with the Light XL. Now, let's see what new technology Hannah's found back in Hall 4. Van Gogh launched its new augmented reality technology earlier this year, and here at the show you can try it out. Known as Van Gogh View AR, the latest innovation enables campers to view tents and awnings from their smartphone or tablet in 3D by scanning a QR code. Available on its range of Sentinel tents and drive away awnings, this means you can view, measure and compare in real space. You can check if a new awning will fit your vehicle or if camping equipment fits the new tent. You can even move around the space with just a few turns of the camera. There are all sorts of innovations here at the show and here in Hall 4 we found this product to help with getting the power you need in your unit. If you use a solar panel when you're camping, you might find yourself repositioning it throughout the day so that you can make sure that it's facing the sun and to maximise the amount of sunlight that it takes in. However, the solar lander from British company Nagonic Designs means that your solar panel sits on a base that will move to track the sun throughout the day, so you don't have to keep adjusting it to get the best results. If you're a fan of 4x4s and off-roading, you'll know Australian brand ARB is one of the largest manufacturers of rugged off-road accessories, but it's also known for its camping ranges. In addition to the 4x4 ready rooftop tents and retractable awnings, be sure to check out ARB's cool Outback drawer system, which includes a full slide-out kitchen. This range of modular cooking kit has been designed to fit neatly into the back of a four-wheel drive vehicle, giving you that sense of freedom wherever you go. 
So even if you're not taking on an extreme adventure, you'll be safe in the knowledge you'll always have the means of making a cup of tea to hand. And if you prefer to go adventuring in a caravan, there's loads of new models to explore here at the show. And you can even brush up on your towing skills for free by taking part in one of the towing courses the club is running here in partnership with Subaru. Dream bigger, think smaller. That's the message from Bailey as it showcases its second generation Discovery range on display to the public for the first time. The range of compact, lightweight caravans includes two popular layouts from the previous series, the two berth D42 and the four berth D44, which have both been tweaked. There's also an all new layout, the D44L. This has a parallel seat front lounge, which creates a double bed and a side dinette with a swing up bunk that gives you an extra two single beds. It also has a large kitchen, a modern washroom and the premium quality interior you'll find across the range. You'll be able to see our full review of the D42 in the May issue of Campion Caravanning and on our YouTube channel. And we'll be testing the all new D44L very soon. There seem to be fewer caravans on display at the show than in the past and continental built units are in particularly short supply. But Klaus Weinsberg is the exception to the rule with a good variety of models on show, including the teardrop shaped tab, the ever youthful sport and fun, and a very smart camper van from Weinsberg that's a neat coach built motorhome but squeezed into a camper van sized footprint. Highlighting the national nature of the caravan camping and motorhome show, Northern Ireland retailer Jan's Lifestyle showed off its new partnership with camper van manufacturer Bespoke. The company sells VW T6 Highline and Startline camper vans that have NCC whole vehicle type approval and VW approval. The features inside, they aren't overly busy, so they would suit you if you want to see this as an everyday vehicle with the ability to go camping rather than a pure touring unit. But with a starting price of £54,000, it's more competitively priced than some other conversion companies. In back-to-back -back years at the Caravan Camping and Motorhome Show, Auto Sleepers has made a big splash in the world of camper vans. Last year, we saw them return to using a Ford-based vehicle, but for 2023, the Mark is introducing a Mercedes model. It is a fully stocked camper van with a stand-up shower and toilet, a tall multi-side opening fridge freezer, an oven and grill with four burner gas hob, plus a sink and a microwave. This prototype won't be cheap when it hits the market at around six figures. But if you can afford it, you'll probably want it. We started by looking at tiny tents, so it seems appropriate to end with the largest camping unit here. These are Morellos, German motorhomes on classic Mercedes chassis. This particular one has a maximum mass of 12 tonnes, so you'll need to upgrade your car driving licence to drive it, as well as forking out £467,000. But for that, you get unparalleled luxury down to an electronic opening for doors, so you don't even need to pull a handle to enter this boutique apartment. That's all for this year, but if you're planning on coming to the show this weekend, make sure you visit the club stand for a friendly welcome. And check out the April issue of Camping and Caravanning magazine for a full report. But if you like this video, hit the button below and share it with your friends. And if you want to be notified when we release more reviews on this video channel, subscribe and sign up to being a member by visiting campingandcaravanningclub.co.uk. Happy camping and caravanning.